number th- my third question for today is our sin nature masked by our culture as mental illness can we say uh, could we say that we all or could we say that we all mental illness is really just our sin nature on display questions a little bit choppy for example a narcissist is prideful selfish arrogant manipulative but isn't this how all humans are apart from Christ? Okay, well, first of all, you're, you're getting into a field that uh, is outside of my expertise. Here's what I do believe. I do, that, I do believe that mental illness is a reality, okay? And not m- all mental illness is the result. Well, I want to be careful in what I say, so hear me out. All mental illness is the result of sin because we live in a sin-fallen world, and uh, if sin didn't exist, mental illness wouldn't exist. But not all mental illness is directly sin. Sometimes it is a medical, physical abnormity or whatever it may be, uh, in, in, uh, uh, a chemical imbalance or whatever people may want to call it, bipolarism. You know, I do believe that mental illness is real. Okay. Let me say that. And I believe that those who struggle with mental illness need to get help. But not all things that are labeled mental illness are mental illness. You're right. Some things are just sin and people need to repent. I mean, I think that label gets thrown around a lot. Like you say, there's someone who's a classic narcissist and they're prideful and they're selfish and they're self-promoting and they're boastful and they're arrogant. And what they need is salvation. But yet, in many cases, they're labeled as having a mental illness. So I do agree with you that not all things that are labeled mental illness are the result of mental illness. Sometimes it's just people who need to repent and get saved. But I do believe that mental illness is a reality. And and those of us who are not trained in that area need to be very careful about what we say and about what we do. Now, we always want to stand upon the Word of God, and I do believe that the Bible has answers for people who struggle with mental illness. I believe that Christ is the answer to mental illness. I believe that the, the, that the, the Bible is, 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 is sufficient to address those issues. But I also believe that there is something in, in a lot of people, there's something physically wrong, and they need to seek help in people who are trained in that area, medical professionals. All right.